Hi everyone, I was really excited to be in class with you yesterday. I had uh, one follow-up question that I wanted to record a, um, a video about, and that was uh, sources for international um, information, so about um, nations other than the United States. So I would say that the same thing kind of applies here. You go in and thinking about that who cares question. Um, so that who cares question could not only be the discipline, so it could be international studies, international and global studies, um, but it could also uh, be um, like in terms of thinking bureaucratically. I don't think I used that phrase yesterday, thinking bureaucratically, but it's one that I use a lot. Um, it's kind of like who cares, but it more follows the structure of um, governments and organizations. So when you're thinking bureaucratically, if you're looking for data or something like that, you could say, well, who had to collect that data? And then to whom was that data reported or what entity or agency? And then you kind of go up the hierarchical chain. So that's what thinking bureaucratically means. You can also think about stakeholders for international issues. So um, are there NGOs, websites like that that you could go to? Some of the research guides do link to data sources or articles and stuff that do come from a um, global focus. In public, it, it also really depends on what your research question is. So um, try and look and see if there's stuff uh, related internationally under the subject that you're talking about. So like if you're going to psychology. Um, so that might be one tip. If you are still trying to find international sources and it's not working out for you, um, another another few places that you could look, look at the government information guide and it has links to international NGOs and international governments. Um, and then also email me with your more specific question and we can do some troubleshooting together. Again, it was awesome to be with you all yesterday. Thank you for your feedback about Zoom. Um, I will do my best next time to practice my screen sharing um, and watch some helpful videos so that it gets smoother for um, students coming down the pike. Have a good one.